You're back. How did it go? We should trouble us no further. Well, that's our bloody relief. So you put down old Garm, did you? Yeah. Sort of. Atreus, your decision to go to Asgard after all he's put us through. I'll never understand it. But I hope you at least came back with something we can use. I hope so, too. Come on, let me show you what Odin's up to. Here's what he cares about most. More than Ragnarok or anything is this mask. Anyone recognize it? That thing? Ugh, oh, it's a dead end. He's been faffing around with that since before I knew him. To be honest, I thought the giants were just having a laugh with that one. Okay, fine. No. You're wrong, Mimir. This mask is no fraud. The giants didn't make it, and only a few of them ever glimpsed it in their visions. They never knew its origin, but some believed it was a way to gaze into the secrets of creation itself. Is it an oracle? Much, much more. Imagine becoming one with a source of infinite knowledge. This? This is why Odin tortured me. So what do you think? Know it? No. It's one obsession he never saw fit to share with me. But I'll tell you this. Even when Odin speaks the truth, his purpose is false. Either way, it's a mistake to let it distract us. Is Heimdall our focus or not? We will rewrite our fate another way. Then I'm going back to Vanaheim. If we're not taking the fight to Odin, I should help my brother stand against him. Join her when we can. Father, I'm gonna study my notes on the mask. See if I can think of a plan. But if you want to go anywhere, I'm with you. And listen, everyone. I'm really sorry about the way I left. You know I've never hurt any of you on purpose. Well, when you can turn into a bear by accident, I suppose these things can happen. So, do you forgive me? Of course, Atreus. We know you meant no harm, lad. Sandry? I'm sure I will. Eventually. Okay. Guess I'll take it. While we're clearing the air, I hope that I can be forgiven for not doing more when the Hellwalkers attacked. Whatever reservations I have about violence, they shouldn't apply when your home is under attack. And certainly not by undead abominations. Yet I reached for a shield instead of a sword. You were right to chide me for that, old friend. The next time the moment calls me, I'll be ready. Well said, Tyr. I believe you just might. I'm just gonna keep working on this till you're ready to head out. I think I need to clear my head. Freya has made her room so verdant and calming. Suppose she'd mind. Ah, oh, much better. Care to join me, Kratos? Have a seat, think about your breathing, try and find stillness in your mind? No. Brother, 
before we check on Freya, is there any unfinished business in other realms you wanted to take care of? I'm sure the lad would love to help. <laughs> 